and welcome back to EA Sports. I am James Cebulski, one of the hottest teams in the NHL will look to keep their heater going tonight. We are just seconds away now from puck drop. The Marlies win the draw and they'll start on the attack. Good solid check and he loses control of it. And he takes the feed. Nice dish from the left wing. Providence is playing it from the side. Oh, what a save on the play! Wow! Oh, that's grand larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. Play continues here, but this crowd's still buzzing. Oh! So a little home cooking pays off as they get on the board quickly here. You gotta love the home cooking, James, as this team really fires up the crowd with that start and sending a clear message they want this game. Toronto's been pushing hard here early in this first period, and look at that. Their hard work pays off with a goal. Uh, there's so many mini-games within a game, James, and to start the period, you can look at it as one. And they have certainly dominated in that area, and that when you start the game like this, you dictate the pace, and that's exactly what they wanted to do, and send a strong message to their away opponent that when you come into our barn, you're not going away with the W. The Marlies gain the zone. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. The Bruins will play from the defensive zone. Takes the feed. Pass in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Stops him again. The Lolka's dialed in and anticipating the play so effectively, making a huge save from a dangerous spot on the ice. Puck grab by Veselainen. And that doesn't reach the net. Picked up along the boards by Kaiser. With the save. Subban's got the puck and will hang on for the whistle. Well, he hasn't been busy, James, but he makes a key save right there. Really important that he keeps his head and focus in the game. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Toronto's up one zip. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. Veloso's a great goalie who can steal a game for his club. Subban's known around the league for being solid between the pipes. He'll look to live up to that reputation. Now, as I send it back upstairs, I'll be watching out for one of these players to give their team a chance to win tonight. Nice zone entry from the middle. There's the whistle as the play was offside. Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Providence has got it in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Veselainen. A centering chance! And he ups to backtrack here with the play. Subban's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. And somehow he hangs on. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Quick feed to Voigt. The Bruins take possession here in the open ice. Arnie Paul tries to pick his corner and puts it off the outside of the post. The Thunderbirds, they're trying to shrink their deficit in this game. They're playing aggressive in the offensive zone, and they just wire one off the post as they try and claw their way back in. Oh, what a save of the play! Whoa! He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. As we look at that last save again, James, it is absolutely incredible and so impressive to see a goaltender just out-battle and out-will his opponent to find the puck. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, the Marlies have taken a 1-0 lead. And they win the offensive zone face-off, and here we go. And it takes a shot, and that's turned aside by Subban. Here's a feed in front. Great defensive heads-up play to pick it off. Subban's opted to hang on to the puck for a face-off. 
Providence has got the lead in shots. Nevertheless, they still trail here in the first. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Can't get it to go. Takes the puck along the boards. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. The Roadrunners have been stealing pucks all game, and when you intercept passes and you find ways to get your sticks in lanes, you typically find a way to possess the puck, but they've got to open it up here. This game's awfully tight. Here's a shot. Here's a shot. And he meets that one square on to stop it. Past the halfway mark of this period, 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Alexandrov's gained possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. Moves the pass in front, and that goes off a body in a ride. Breaks it up with the poke check. Handles the bank pass from along the boards. The Marlies played along the wing. The Bruins have it against the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Chase in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Moves it to the middle. And that's stopped. Here's a short pass to Shaw. Wax it into the offensive zone. The Bruins will play the puck from behind the net. Sends a pass over. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Slides the puck over to Rikula. With some open space at center. Sends it in front. And that goes off a stick. Subban's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Late goings of this period. Toronto's ahead, 1-0. The Bruins win the draw. Takes the puck at the point. Providence is on the attack. Slides it back to the blue line. Quick feed to Mitchell. Big time stop there. And he loses control of the puck. Takes the feed from the left side. Shot. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Vilalka has made a great save there. I mean, his team is trailing, and the deficit could have been greater. But if he can build on that and get back to the performance he had the other night, I mean, it was a shutout. Imagine the confidence he can give his team and an opportunity to get back in this game. Scooped up along the wall by Veselainen. He's got a stick. That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. Both teams are back at center ice, and we are ready to get period number two underway. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Providence has had the puck a ton in that opening frame, James. That's exactly what you want if you're the coach. You want to manage the puck. You want to own it in the offensive zone. They did just that. They just weren't able to convert. They find themselves trailing by one. If they can trust the process, they'll find their way back into this game. Puts it on there. Oh, what a save! Uh, that doesn't swing momentum in your favor. I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort to make a play. What a beautiful save. want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level. When you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game, you know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Marlies lead it 1-0. The Bruins start with the puck in their own end. Moves it to Alexandrov. And now he moves it quickly to Achari. Moves it to the middle, and he denies that great opportunity there. Slides it quickly to Scandella. Takes it from the right side. Slittering feed, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Golovka 
has been so impressive, in particular in that last sequence, James. And he is out of gas. It didn't prevent him from making that save, but now he's going to get some much-needed rest as that puck heads out of the zone. And that puck leaves the zone. Quick pass to Kaiser. And that's deflected. From the blue line, they take control of it. Toronto's got possession of the puck. The Marlies carry it along the wall. Nowhere for that shot to go through. The Bruins move the puck in the defensive zone. Through center. Feeds it over to Walsh. Oh, and that closes him off against the wall. Huge steal in his own end. Toronto's been working hard all night, James. They've been intercepting pucks. They've had great stick position, and it's been a defense. I love this snapshot from in tight, James, that beats the goaltender, but how about the will to get to those tough areas? I mean, that's what it's all about. You can have the skill, but you've got to have the will. The Marlies have extended the lead to two now here in the second. Yeah, and sometimes as an athlete, you take a bit of a breather here, and sometimes that frees you to continue to play an attack, but sometimes it leads to complacency. You don't want to give any edge to your opponent when you have them down. Oh, great core strength to hang on to the puck after that. The Bruins have it now. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Toborowski. Providence has got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Hall. Smart read by the defender to come up with it. Here's a shot. Turns in the lane. Slides the puck over. Quick pass to Hall. Moves it on over to Toborowski. Providence has got the puck along the wall. Taken by Hall. Here's a shot. Great save. Back at the point, they set it up. Too many bodies in the way. The Marlies gain possession. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Providence has got the puck. Takes the feed. Takes it and looks ahead. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Pokes it away in his own end. Made that stop. Picking up some steam at center ice. Edler's got it in the offensive zone. But well, that's just gonna hang on for a whistle. Stevens has been putting on a clinic in terms of the stats column. He has just been putting up incredible numbers on this point streak and his confidence is just showing every time he shoots the puck. The Bruins win the draw on their own end. Providence is looking to break out. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Centering pass in front, and that doesn't go as it's off a stick. Edler's lugging the puck. Handles the pass. Toronto's going on the attack as they gain the zone. The goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. The Bruins will play it in their own end. Here's a short pass to Alexandrov. Providence has got the puck against the boards. Quick feed to Edler. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Slick feed. The Bruins played along the boards. Oh, spectacular save right there! Wow! Unbelievable! I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. Uh, they always say, to be great, you have to get uncomfortable. As we look at this last save, this looks uncomfortable. Stretching your body, finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save. That's what he did, and that's why the save was made. Here in the late goings of the period, Toronto's got a 2-0 lead. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Fires it! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Moves it to Slavin. Oh, textbook poke check to turn that over. No, you're not going to get away with that one right in front of the official. The late penalty coming up. It's a trick, and it looks like... Sometimes it's just a product of keeping your feet moving, and when you reach and you take your opponent's feet out, you're gonna get the two minutes for tripping. Puck picked up by Villanova. And a 
Beautiful save by the goaltender. Pass back to the point. And that's blocked away. Sends the pass in front. He scores! What a play! The goaltenders are just so good in this league, James. If they see the shot, they are going to stop it. And so you got to get traffic in front of the net. On this power play, they do an excellent job of getting bodies in front of the paint. Toronto's been feeling good all night long, and look at what we're at here. We're still in the late stage of the period here. Yeah, it's been an unbelievable game for them so far. I mean, they've just been so dominant offensively. Their opponent really doesn't know what to do. They're trying to slow the game down, but they can't because they're just on fire in terms of pace and dictating it. This is it to Toborowski. Great pass from off the right side. Moves it around along the half wall. Stopped by the goaltender. Takes a shot. No room for that one to get through. Moves the puck down low. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. Toronto's been working hard on the big stop just as time expires in the period. And with that, two periods now in the books. Been a great night of hockey here on EA Sports, and we got the third period coming at you in moments. Well, this has been an absolute blowout to the first two periods as we get underway here in the third. Two-thirds of the way to the finish line in this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? The Thunderbirds coaches are going to be telling them, listen, you got to just trust the process, stick with the game plan. I mean, through 40 minutes of play, you've dominated possession. Continue to do what you've been doing, but don't get frustrated. Don't panic and force the play. It'll come to you. And he turns that one aside. Here's a chance in front, and that's intercepted. Through pass ahead. Quick pass to Mitchell. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. There's the whistle, and here's the call. The Marlies have been served up with a two-minute penalty for charging. Both teams lining up for the face-off, and it's a chance to see if there's actually some power in this power play. They haven't scored on the power play yet, but they have another up. Puts it off the post. The Thunderbirds can't believe their misfortune as they send one off the post. When you're trailing in a game, you got to find a way to put those ones in and convert your bad luck into some good. Alexandrov's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And it's a quick pass to Kirk. Subban's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been one of their best players all night. A reason why they're leading here in the third, James. But it's not just about the save. It's about managing the puck and making the decisions when to hold on. Alexandros won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. Let's go! Right with the man advantage, and they make it click. Well, James, this is a great play all the way around. A perfect pass to a perfectly executed shot as he sets up and waits for it right in his wheelhouse. Just lets the one-timer rip. Providence has got to dig down and see if they've got a couple more of those on their sticks tonight. If only they could start that way, hey, James? No but they kidding. need to look to finish with desperation and urgency if they want to give themselves an opportunity to even get their tender out. And he takes the pass. Passes it in front. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Great reach with the poke check. Providence has got the puck. The Bruins take it along the wing. Quick feed down low. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Moves it up. To the front. There's a firm collision. Poked away in the offensive end. Mente's got it along the boards. Denies him in front. Subban's been solid here tonight, James. I mean, look at his save percentage. He's been excellent between the crease, and that's making the saves that you need to and you want to at the appropriate moment. Man, his team's been effective going north. Enters the offensive zone from the left. The Marlies look to start the transition game. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. 
Moves it quickly over to Mete. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Providence has got the puck along the wall. Great poke check on the reach. Toronto's regained possession of the puck. Trying to clear. And he slides it quickly to Mete. Passes it over to Walsh. Moves the puck along the half wall. And a stick in the lane deflects that one away. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. Great save by the goaltender to stay with that tip. We got a whistle penalty coming up. Who had the edge in Carlin Bates' line? She's standing by with the answer. Subban's managed to give up less goals in this one, guys, and has even given his team a chance to bring it home. He's got my vote in this matchup. And now he angles it across to Rikula. Providence has got the puck at the defensive end. Gains the zone through the middle. Here's a chance at front. Off the stick, and they can't complete the play. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a chance. Gives them nothing in front. That's an incredible save, James. I mean, he's got presence in his crease, and he's also got a great glove hand, and he shows it right there with that save. Kirk's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. The Marlies will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Oh, great save by Belota! The Bruins pick up steam and are on the attack. Shot! Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Subban! Kaiser is back in the lineup after rehabbing his injury, and he's quick to create some offense there with that nice, dangerous shot. Quick shot! Beautiful glove stop on that one. And he moves it up to Hall. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Sends it down low. Sends the pass in front. What a chance, but that goes off target off a body in front. The Marlies move it in. But he's got the puck on his stick now, and you know he's looking for the hat trick, James. Kick it along the wall by Mitchell. Providence has got a hold of the puck. Here's a short pass to Kaiser. Devastating collision against the wall. I'm not sure if he just got the wind knocked out of him, James, after that enormous hit, or whether there's an injury, but either way, he is really struggling to get back to the bench. Providence has got a hold of it along the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here's a chance in front! Block shot! Moves with the puck in the corner. Jostles for the puck, but still hangs on. The Marlies move it ahead. The Bruins have the puck now. Providence has got him along the wall. What a steal in his own end. Toronto is working hard in all areas of the ice. Defense is structure, and it needs to happen in all three zones. When you're talking about stick positioning, you're doing a great job of taking away passes. And they turn it over in the neutral zone. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. On the attack along the boards. Quick feed to Achari. Blocked by Subban. He reads this play perfectly, James. He gets tight to the shooter. There's no room to put it by him. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Moves it to Vilma. And he takes the dish. Quick stop by Malta. Well, he's flashing the leather on this save. The shooter's in a great A scoring area. And man, he just whips out the glove and makes the save. Yeah.